1 Corinthians chapter 6 verse 13b Now the body is not for sexual immorality but for the Lord, and the Lord for the body. Okay. I'm just going to set aside the sexual immorality part for the purposes of this particular devotion. With or without it, the scripture packs the same punch. Now the body is for the Lord and the Lord for the body. Your body is for God. Really stop and think about that. Why is he so concerned about your body? Because it is his voice to speak, his hands to heal, and his feet to go. Without your body, you are just a spirit, and spirits can't do anything without a body. There is no speaking, no touching, and no going without it. He knows that you can't fulfill your call, your God-given purpose, without the use of a fully functioning body. He needs you healthy and whole. Your body is your ally in fulfilling your destiny. Stop looking at it as your enemy. God gave you your body so you could be him in the flesh to those around you that need him. Speak words of blessing over your body today. Bless it. Don't curse it. Speak words of life, healing, and restoration over it and into it.